Hello everybody and welcome to my brand new YouTube channel. Now this channel is going to be featured on swimming and in this first video I'm going to be reviewing the Form Smart Swim Goggles. First of all, I would like to start the video by saying a massive thank you to Form Swim Goggles. Now these guys are people that I wrote to this summer of 2020 and I heard back from them last month to say that they really believe in what I do. I am a Paralympic swimmer. I competed at the Rio 2016 Paralympic Games for Great Britain and I've coached myself since 2015. So for me, I believe form swim goggles are the perfect fit because I don't have a swimming coach on poolside that can time me or tell me my splits, stroke rates, and all the information I really need to be able to succeed in swimming. Now today is the second day in the UK after the second lockdown that swimmers can go to a swimming pool to train. It is gonna be my first session back and what perfect timing. Once I have completed my training session in the pool, I'm going to give you some feedback. I'm going to be running through some pros and some cons, tell you everything you need to know, and basically give you a review on how I found these swim goggles performing in the pool. These form smart swimming goggles have been out just over a year, I believe, maybe slightly longer. I've never used them before, so I'm really excited to be able to tell you how I find these goggles. The Form Smart Swim Goggles are the next generation. They are the new breed in terms of performance levels that you can expect from a pair of goggles. They really are leading the way in terms of performance in the pool and the data you can expect to obtain from this product. The technology means that you do not need a swimming coach. Now I used to have a swimming coach, I belong to a club still, however I am a public swimmer. I swim in public time with the knowledge that I do have already from swim coaching and being able to combine that to try and coach myself the best way possible. If you are going or rocking up to a pool without a swimming coach, it gives you data. What more could you ask for? Because of the technology and the data that can be obtained by the swimmer, Form have created an app that syncs up with the goggles itself. So this means that when you finish a workout or finish a swim, whether it be indoors or maybe an open water swim, you can link the goggles to the app and get data and look back and really log your training sessions. I've always found that since I've coached myself, I'm constantly on my iPhone writing notes about the session, how I felt, what times it is that I achieved in the pool. I've never had an app that can link straight to what my swim session was. These goggles literally tell you key information about your swim. And for me, I think that's perfect, not just for me, but for loads of other swimmers around the country and around the world that will go to a public swim session and they want to know more data. So these goggles really are perfect. So let's unbox these beauties. This is what it looks like. It's really good packaging. On the back, it does tell you a little bit about the product itself. You can see the uh, the metrics on here. Now this is what the goggles will look like through the lens uh, when you are swimming in the pool, depending on what uh, you, you set the goggles up to show you. As you can see, it gives you a rough idea of um, what to expect from these goggles timer splits it can tell you the distance that you swim your stroke count how many strokes you do on each length and the the rate that your arms are going at obviously a lot of elite swimmers and people that race maybe masters as well will be interested in their stroke rate how quick they're turning their arms over and they will know or should know from a coaching point of view what their optimum stroke rate and stroke count should really be uh, this is something that we will be talking about in another video. It tells you your heart rate, 
And then, like I said, with the with the Form Swim app, you can then sync the goggles to the app on your phone, and this will give you complete feedback of your swim. You can see that when you first unbox uh, these Smart Swim goggles, they do come with a protective case. Now, I think that is something that's really good and professional. Uh, there's been countless goggles that I have for over the years that don't come in any protective uh, casing. So I think this is a really good added bonus to the product. You get the goggles come in the case with extra nose clips and a charging cable. The charging cable will be able to sync with a USB port um, because you do need to charge the goggles. Fully charged goggles um, will allow you to have 16 hours of charge so that you can use this multiple times, multiple sessions before you have to recharge the goggles again. So that's another really big plus of this product. Something else you do get with this product is a polar heart rate sensor. Now this slots onto the side of the goggles and again you can access data on the app that you can download onto your phones, uh, your smartphones and this will obviously give you your heart rate and you can depending on what training zones you're training for etc this can be a really good tool. We've got the casing in front of me and here they are. As a swimmer, there's nothing better than being able to put some new goggles on, and particularly when they're high tech like these. So um, they're looking pretty good. I can't wait to go and use them in the pool this afternoon. There's six different nose clips that come with these goggles in addition to the, to the nose clip that's already attached. Um, if you pull this and take the goggles out and then the charging cable is within the pack itself. This will connect with a USB port so you can then charge your goggles up. It just slots on the side magnetically and then like I said, you can plug this into a USB port. So these goggles did actually come uh, partly charged when I unboxed them. I've turned them on and my phone's not um, too or super clear in terms of being able to pick up the projection. That is what the goggles look like. So on the right lens, the right goggle lens, um, I've turned it on Turn the goggles on via a button on the side and it's basically telling me to connect to the form app but just so you guys get an idea of uh, what this actually looks like after unboxing these smart swim goggles i have been syncing the goggles to my phone via the the app that i've downloaded off the apple store it's all straightforward teaches you gives you basic steps to sync the, the goggles up. It's, you, you really can't get it wrong, which is really good. Um, it comes with battery life already, so that means I can get straight to the pool when I'm done videoing this. When you look through the lens itself, um, you've got a screen or menu of what you want to select. So you can pick lap swimming, you can select the pool that you're going to swim in, whether that be 25 meters or 50 meters. You do have an open water option as well, which is, again, that's a great addition. You can also select intervals or lap timing. There's different options that I will play about with today and feed back towards uh, you guys watching this video. And I will see you on the other side.
Okay, so I am back from swim training. It was really nice to get back in for the first time in just over a month. In terms of where I am myself swimming at the moment, uh, I do have a shoulder issue that I, I hoped had gone, um, but is still niggling away. Um, so I need to get that sorted, hoping to see a physio whenever I can. The session itself um, was pretty easy. A few drills and skills, technique based, um, a little bit of fitness. It was just really nice to build back into the pool, obviously with a, a bit of pain in the shoulder, um, but it is what it is. And however, I did really appreciate um, being able to jump straight in with some new goggles, which was different, I have to say. So I really did enjoy using them. I think the main uh, part that people will look at straight away is the, the bulky size. Now, obviously this is slightly different to swim with. Uh, I didn't find this an issue at all. Considering what the goggles can do, you don't really notice uh, the, the bulkier side when you're swimming. And I find that's a, a massive plus, considering that all the data that you get back from the goggles. During the training session itself, I never had a problem with the goggles leaking. They seem to fit really well. I did swap out the nose clip for a smaller one, and it, it's a perfect fit. The, the inside of the goggles, um, they're not, some goggles are, are quite solid and these are, are nice and soft on the eyes. Um, they do fit quite close to the eyes, which is perfect. That That's what I like from a pair of goggles. I know most elite swimmers will agree with me and they don't like goggles that sort of sit too wide. The, the most interesting part of these goggles is what it is they do with the projection and the information that it feeds back to you whilst you're swimming. This is something that I haven't been used to and it was fascinating. I have to say it was fascinating. I was swimming up and down and even though I had an easier or easy session to build back into things, um, I kept wanting to change the session up just to try uh, different aspects of what the goggles can do. They are a game changer. They offer more than what any other goggle can do. Yes, you could argue that it's on the bulky side, um, but in the pool itself, that didn't really bother me. I had a swim cap over the top. The goggles never leaked at all. Even being this size, that's fine. I got some fantastic uh, insights to my own training. I think the feedback that you will get from these is fantastic. If you're a swimmer that doesn't belong to a swim club and you go to the pool and swim on your own and you want to know lots of different bits of information about your swimming, these are absolutely unbelievable. Uh, you'll have a lot of fun with these. And I had a lot of fun on, on my first training session with these. It makes you want to do things that you might not do normally and time yourself and make sure you're quicker on the first 50 or first 100 of your swim, for example. And this is a little bit of a, a motivating factor. You can see that in front of your eyes, the time that you're going, the stroke rates that you're hitting and how many strokes you're doing per length, it depends what setting you put these goggles on as to what it shows in the actual uh, lens itself. But I found it really motivating. Due to the new technology that these goggles offer, people will look at the pricing and think it's quite expensive. Is it worth the money? If you're asking me, absolutely. These goggles are game changers. To be able to see that whilst swimming is something that I never thought I would see um, in my time in the swimming pool at least. They are really worth investing money in. There's lots of feedback, there's lots of different setups that you can have with these goggles. It all syncs to your phone. You can get out of the pool and as long as your goggles and smartphone are close to each other and sync to each other, as soon as you unlock the app or go onto the form swim app, the goggles sync. As long as you've turned them on as well, obviously, you have to have your goggles on. It's pretty instant. Straight away, uh, my workout loaded and I was able to have access to a lot of data that I would never normally have. I think even before when I've had a swim coach, uh, there's elements of training where you don't get that much feedback and with these it's constant you can 
There might even be too much feedback, but at least you've got the data there to then tap into if you're interested in that. The only factor during my training session that I struggled with, with these goggles, was the lack of peripheral vision. Now, as you can see, the bulkier side, you're not going to be able to see out to the side. Um, I found that when I was dolphin kicking off the wall on my back, because I'm used to a wider view uh, peripheral with my goggles that I would normally train with, um, and these look pretty much straight up or straight in front of you, I struggled with this to start with, to know whereabouts I actually am in the pool underwater. I was still blown away by the product itself overall. So I would 100% recommend these. This is the first video on my new channel. And obviously it goes without saying that I don't want to just produce one video. I am looking at producing many videos each week where I'm going to do some product reviews like the video today about me and my swimming career. The main part and the main bulk of the videos are going to be coaching tips to help you swim better. If you want to see more videos from me on this channel, then please hit the subscribe button down below and I will see you in the next video.